Welcome back everyone, this is Renton the Gaming Master with some more Super Mario World for the Super Nintendo. Alright, so in today's episode we will be tackling the Forest of Illusion portion of the Secret Exits. And before we do that, we're actually going to play the Cheese Bridge area because there is a secret exit in this level. Uh, I didn't really know what to do with this level because I wasn't going to make a whole video for just one level, so I'm just going to kind of put it with the Forest of Illusion levels. So let's go ahead and jump on into it. So you will need Yoshi for this to work. Uh, you can get him pretty easily if you play, like, Yoshi's Island 2 or something. I think that's where I got Yoshi. You can just go in there and get Yoshi and then exit the level and come to this level. That's exactly what I did, at least. Oh, so yeah, the secret exit in this level is actually at the very end, so we're just gonna play, like, normal throughout the whole level. Don't really have to do anything differently, just make sure you keep Yoshi with you. And, uh, yeah, you should be good to go. We're just gonna play, like, normally for now. And grab this Yoshi coin. Sweet, there we go. Try to stay on the top path, and you'll see why in a little bit. But yeah, just playing like normal. So this is why you want to ride the top path. Or, I guess the middle path would work, too. But the bottom path kind of leads to death, it looks like, so... Uh, we don't need that. Now, luckily, we don't need any... We don't need to hold on to any of the railings, because we can make all of these jumps, which is nice. So that way, we can indeed bring Yoshi with us. We got another cape there. Awesome. So yeah, we're good there. Whoa, okay. A little too fast there. So this part looks scary, but it's really not that bad. You literally just jump around and you should be good. Now, here's where it gets hard. <clears throat> so what we're actually going to do is we're going to go behind the flagpole. Uh, which is going to be a little bit tough. We have to like jump and then jump off of Yoshi. My recommendation is to wait for the white part to be at the top when you jump. So that way you don't bump into it when you do your jump. So let's see if we can do it. Hey, we did it. Okay, nice. Okay, then we can grab the moon, which gives us three one-ups, I believe. Very nice. And yeah, that level's done now. So, ladies and gentlemen, we can now move on to the Forest of Illusion. Which will be awesome. We can also come down here and do the Soda Lake, but that'll be for a different video. Oh yeah, let's come down here. Let's go ahead and jump on into the Forest of Illusion. Now, some of these secret exits I actually did play for the Let's Play portion of this game. Uh, however, I'm going to play it again because these videos are specifically designed for the secret exit. So, kind of use it as a guide if you want when you're playing the game yourself. You know, you can kind of follow along with all my tips and uh, get the secret exits yourself. So, we're going to jump into Forest of Illusion 1 to start things off. So, I don't believe you need any power-up or Yoshi or anything for this level, uh, which is quite nice. There's a fire flower up there. I'm just going to stick with my two capes for now, though. Uh, we can do a little bit of that, though, to take out that guy. We've got a Yoshi in here, so even though we had to sacrifice the Yoshi, we can get him right back. Uh, so that's pretty nice. We can grab these apples. Alright, awesome. We can get a 1-up in here. Oh, I missed it, dang it. Yeah, that's a little bit of a harder 1-up to collect, but... We should be good. Alright, watch out for those guys. Yeah, I mean, I guess you don't really need power-ups or Yoshi, but... Certainly doesn't hurt to take them with, am I right? Here, grab the cape. There we go. Oh my gosh, dude. Yoshi! Oh my god, really? Wow, so glad I went back for this thing. <laughs> god, okay. Well, I guess we got another cape out of it, so... Could have been worse, I suppose. Oh, Yoshi, dude, you're joking. Why am I having so much trouble with Yoshi there? Alright, so here's what we want to do. So, let's back out of the way. We're actually going to grab the Pea Balloon power-up. And the way you normally complete this level is by heading to the right, but we're actually going to head down here and to the left. And you guys will see why in just a moment. Just don't die to the Koopa there. So yeah, we're just going to kind of wait for the Pea, blo the pea Balloon to wear off really quickly. And then we're going to grab the key, put it through the keyhole, and boom, that is the secret exit. Now, you'll notice that nothing really unlocks, because I've already done that one on the Let's Play, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but yeah, it'll unlock another path and whatnot, so let's go ahead and do the Ghost House next. So we're gonna head into the Ghost House, and we're gonna show you guys the secret exit. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play through it pretty much the same way, uh, that you'd normally play it. Just with one little exception that you'll see in a little bit. So unfortunately we lost the cape, which is just great. Oh well, we'll have to bear through it. 
Oh, but. <clears throat> okay. So, yeah, so watch out for all these enemies. Just get through here. Is there a power up in this one, maybe? I hope there is. Yes, there is. Okay. You don't need a power up to get the secret exit, but it can help. <laughs> and I just lost it within like two seconds. Sounds about right, honestly. Alright, we're just gonna have to get through here. There's a lot of ghosts, so yeah. Try to watch out for them. Uh, we will need to take the P-switch up here. There we go. I knew it was nearby. Don't go through that door, though. We're actually gonna want to go through this door right here. The P-switch door. Now, here's what we do. We come up here. And this door right here, that's right about here. This is the door to normally beat this level. However, for the secret exit, it's super easy. Literally, all you have to do is make your way over here. And then once the screen stops, you'll know that you've reached it. It's this door right here. We're going to go through it. And boom, the secret exit has a moon for you, which gives you three one-ups, which is awesome. And yeah, that's the secret exit. So that's really cool that you get three one-ups just for doing it. Yeah, it's not hard at all. You don't need any other power-ups. You don't need Yoshi. It's literally all you have to do is walk left more. <laughs> and that's literally all you have to do. It's that simple. We'll go ahead and continue and save. And yeah, we'll move on to Forest Evolution 2 next. <clears throat> so we have the green block over here. So y there are rewards for obviously obtaining the... Or activating the green switch. So we got like a free power up there, which is nice. Uh, we're going to watch out for the spikes. See, I believe the secret exit in this level, it's not actually hard to get, but it might be a little hard to, like, follow the correct path. I was screwed there no matter what. I don't know how to navigate a power up through this. We're going to wait for the spike. Oh, dude, are you joking? I... <laughs> Man, the physics are so much different when you have that block. You just start flying all over the place. It's crazy. Oh, sweet. We don't even need a mushroom. We just get the cape. So, yeah. Definitely activate all those blocks if you can. There's no punishment for doing so or anything. So, is it even possible to bring a power up through this section? I don't even know. It doesn't feel possible. I'm sure there's a way, though. Who knows? Alright, we're gonna make our way up here. We don't really need that block. We can just chuck it out of the way. Is that coming up? Yep, I knew it. Okay. Yeah, watch out for... The spike shenanigans. Okay, yeah. I don't like not having a power-up at all. It's not what I wanted. Okay. Oh, dude, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I thought I was gonna die there. We seem to be doing good, though. We're just gonna fly up here, get the power-up before I die and do something stupid. There we go. Already looking a lot better. Which you love to see. Oh, sure, we can grab the Yoshi coin. Just don't wake up that fish. Uh, of course we woke it up. Alright, that's fine. Yeah, watch out for all of this. So yeah, just kind of make your way to the right side of the screen for the most part. And I'll tell you guys when to change directions. Alright, watch out for the spike. Nice, okay. Here's what we want to do. Watch out for that, first of all. We want to come down here, so now we want to go down to the left. So sure, we can get the bonus mushroom. Nope, too late. <laughs> I'm not going for it now. Yeah, we just want to literally come over to the left, and boom, here's our key. Put it through the keyhole, and boom, there we go. So now, Forest Evolution 2 is taken care of. And by doing the secret exit in this level, we actually unlock another switch palace. This time it's the blue switch palace. Uh, so that's pretty nice. I don't even know what really the point of this is, but I guess you can do a little bit of that. Can I even make that jump? Yes, I can. Just for some free coinage. How many coins I get? Okay. We got a little bit of coins, I'm sure. Oh, we're almost to 100 coins. Can I get 10 more in this room? Doesn't look like it. <clears throat> we're only 5 away, though, so that's nice. Alright, through the pipe. And let's go activate the blue switch. Here we go. Boom. So the power of the switch you have pushed will turn all the highlighted blue blocks into solid blue blocks. Your progress will also be saved. Alright, awesome.
We'll gladly take that. And now what? We only got two more levels, I believe? So that's pretty cool. So now that we got that taken care of, let's go ahead and jump into Forest of Illusion 3. We'll go in chronological order, because why not? Uh, for this level, I believe you need a at least some sort of power-up where Mario can spin-jump on blocks. So do you keep that in mind. So it doesn't have to be the cape, necessarily. Uh, but even if you have a mushroom, that's just fine. <clears throat> so we're gonna grab this bonus mushroom, because in case I take damage. Because this level is a little tricky sometimes. Not overly complicated. Oh, we'll take the spring at this, spit it out. We can do the super jump there. Ooh, I wish I had the ca- oh. We need the mushroom, dude. I wish I had- oh my god! <laughs> dude, what- oh my god, what is happening? I could- my brain is not computing right now. Hold up, we're gonna give that one another go, because I needed it in a mushroom anyway. My brain was just not working there or something, I don't know. Don't even ask me what that was about, dude. That was just a series of unfortunate events right there. Boom, we'll check that over there. Sure, give me Yoshi. Alright, and I need my mushroom again. Big to- oh, mushroom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, there we go. Alright, peace has been restored. Never mind. No! Oh my god, dude. Yoshi, what the heck? Yoshi, stop running away from me, dude. Okay, there we go. Peace has been restored now. We're doing good. Alright, we actually do need to take the spring with us, I believe. Or at least I'm going to, because I want to keep Yoshi. Oh my god, you unbelievable. God, this game sucks sometimes. No, Mario World's great, it just, that was dumb. Like, why does that gotta happen so many times, dude? It's a little garbage, if you ask me. Alright, there we go, we got bonus mushroom. Man, I really wish I had Yoshi. That kind of stinks. Oh well. Too late now, so... Hopefully I can get another power-up here. Is there another power-up? Oh no, there's not. Okay. I'm not literally checking all of these blocks for a power-up, so... Plus, we got a bonus mushroom, so we should make it. But yeah, we're just gonna put like, the level like normal. Uh, for those that are following along with. Oh boy. We actually want to go down this pipe. Check it out. Because look, we need to spin jump on these blocks. Bam. Then we just bring the key through the hole. And boom, there we go. Alright, last level. We got Forest of Illusion 4. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. Okay, like that. There we go. Alright, Forest of Illusion 4, last level. Oh, we can grab a free one-up at the start. Who doesn't love a free one-up? Oh my god, I forgot how annoying this level is because of Lakitu. Oh, dude, who asked for Lakitu? My god. We're taking Lakitu out. Dude, there's so many Lakitus in this level, I forgot about that, dude. We're gonna need a cape for this level, I believe. Or Yoshi. Cape or Yoshi. And you'll see why in a little bit. Oh, dude, that is such trash! That is such trash! Dude, this game sometimes is not fair. I don't know if I can do the secret exit now, because I freaking lack it to you, dude. Who asked for lack it to? Who asked? Seriously. Unbelievable. Get out of here. You're done. You're toast. Yeah, we need to somehow get through that pipe, and I think you need either a cape or a Yoshi to jump off. Wow, that is so frustrating. Unless we hit this piece, which is not happen. I'm gonna see if maybe those will turn into solid blocks. I really hope so. We'll see. Does it? No, it doesn't. What? That's lame. Oh, dude, and then that Koopa comes out of nowhere. 
All right, we're gonna give this another go. We're gonna watch out for all of the stupid Blackity shenanigans. Because no one wants that. Like, literally no one. There we go. Oh, <laughs> dude. I swear if Blackity pulls something. We're just going through it. Ready? Boom. We're gonna fly it. And then we're gonna go on top of this pipe right here, okay? There we go. That's right, baby. Now we can take the key into the hole, and boom. There we go. Those were all of the Forest Illusion Secret Exits, guys. So we're gonna move on to Chocolate Island, I believe. Isn't that what's next? Yeah, that's right. We'll move on to Chocolate Island in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more Super Mario World. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have a good rest of your day.